Hey everybody and welcome back to Terraria. When we last left off, we were finding marble biomes. That was it. Finding marble biomes and using that to get enough... I forgot how deep this was. Using that to get enough marble for uh, our let's build, which is unfortunately still not finished. So I can go back to my world and show you. So we are here. Uh, and I figured if we're going to spend some time in this world, I need to figure out a plan of, you know, something to do so we're not just messing around. Uh, so I've figured out a couple of things I want to do. I'm going to get that. There we go. I figured out a couple of things that I want to do. So first of all, uh, I'm going to open up my inventory and show you. I brought with me my Tinkerer's Workshop from the other world. So I'm going to take it back to the world when I leave, but for now, this is what I have, and it's placed. So now, with this Tinkerer's Workshop, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take off my freaking Cloud in a Balloon. Let's make the Cloud the cloud in a Balloon with a horseshoe thing. So I no longer take fall damage, which is a huge deal. Blue Horseshoe Balloon allows her to double jump, increases jump height, and negates fall damage. Thank you. It's a menacing one. Ooh, plus 4% damage. Plus 4% damage, that's amazing. So, we now jump. Do that. Whoa, we... Do we go even higher? Like, that alone seems like a big jump. And then that on top seems even further. Oh, the no fall, no fall damage is great. Uh, I also was going to bring with me the obsidian. So that I could make the obsidian skull, but I forgot to do that because I'm an idiot. So, what I'm going to do is quickly put that on there, that on there, bring out the pig. Put my Tinkerer's Workshop in here so I no longer forget it. In fact, I can just do that. Then what I'm going to do is quickly go to my options menu because so many of you are asking how to get the um, quick select. Like, what I'm doing now, look, Magic Mirror and the money, money Trough. You go to Controls, you have to have Custom Settings, I, I believe. Actually, I don't know. Um, but then, anyway, you go down to Quick Navigation, and you'll see here, look, Direction Buttons Hotbar, you want to enable that. Once that's enabled, you can then assign the up, down, left, right things on your menu, which is uh, good, but also unfortunate. Because it means you can't, um, I mean, you have to re-enable them every time you load into a world, which sucks. I don't know why it doesn't remember that. Anyway, so, do we have a goal for today? Yes. I'm also going to try and keep these videos shorter, because the last one I did was an hour long. Um, you know, let's get on with doing what I'm doing while I'm talking. Um, the last one I made was an hour long. Am I going to die? <laughs> the last one I made was an hour long, and then I didn't have one on the Sunday. So here's quickly, just to let you know, the schedule for Terraria. Every day, unless I can't be bothered. That's that's just the general rule for Terraria. I, I will upload it every single day, unless there's a day where I just can't be bothered to upload it, so I won't. So uh, I do record these either on the day or the day before. And the reasoning for that is because um, I don't want to get too far ahead because you guys like leaving me comments and I like reading your comments and some of them are very uh, appropriate for where I'm at and they help me. Uh, so some other things to talk about uh, are, yes, the episode length. Some of you like the long episodes, some of you like the shorter episodes. I've seen more people, not exactly complain, but say they prefer the shorter videos then I've seen prefer, say, prefer longer videos. And there are a lot of people saying, you know, they don't have time to watch an hour long video. And I completely understand that. So, what I'm going to do is try to keep these to about 20 to half an hour. For now. So today's video will be about 20 to half an hour. So I'm hoping we can do what it is that I wanted to do. In fact, I've already managed to do that. I just nearly killed myself. Can I pick that up? No, I can't. Ooh, I love the new look of the gems. That's cool. So I started digging down here specifically to try and find something. 
And then I found it already. So, um, that's good, I guess. So, one of my goals today is to defeat another boss. What is that boss? Well, I'll tell you. That boss is King Slime. Oh, it's ice down here. I don't see any, but apparently it is. It's tungsten. Silver. Get out of here, Slime. Uh, to defeat another boss. And the boss that I want to... Freaking die trap. The one, the boss that I want to defeat. Oh, well, I do want to beat Skeletron. Oh, there's a railway of, oh, I've been over there. I do want to beat Skeletron, but the problem with fighting Skeletron is this. It doesn't help us out in this world. We need to do it in our own world so we can access the jungle in our own world. And also, the jungle, the dungeon. But also, having the Skeletron defeated means we can then find... The mechanic, who is a very important role for us to have. So I, I, I want to get that done, but I feel like it needs to be done in our own world. It's not, maybe I will do that. Because I can, I can fight him in our world without revealing our base, right? Hey. Because if. When I spawn into our world, I can just <gasps> I can just move the camera away so you don't see our base. Like stop, start recording afterwards. Look at this dead guy with a sword in his chest. And then if I have to die, I can just not cut out the death, but cut out the respawn, so you don't see the base currently. So I could do that. That's definitely something I could do. <gasps> Gold. I want that. That is very definitely something that I can do. I love this background wall here. What is this background wall? I have it. I'm not allowed it. I wanna know what it is, it looks really cool. Also, what's that up there? That was a blink route. I'm gonna mount this gold and then I'm gonna ride the railway because, you know, you can. So yeah, I, w I will be fighting Skeletron, but not right now. Today, my goal is to fight and defeat King Slime. So there are three ways we can do this. Way number one is get Slimer in. But that's a random chance. There's no guarantee that we'll get that. Way number two is uh, go to the edges of the world. And I think that causes him to spawn in sometimes. I think, if I remember rightly. Oh, don't drown me, please. Don't drown me. Can I put a torch on, please? Um, and then, again, that's random chance, hoping he's going to spawn in. And then the other way we can do it is to make a slime crown. Now, I have all of the ingredients. I came here with half of the ingredients, hoping to find the other half, and I found the other half almost instantly. Look at that. I see you there. Yeah. Look at those amethysts. Right over here. But yeah, anyway, so what we need to make a slime crown is slime. Oh, uh, free, I came with two feds. Slime, platinum or gold bars, five of them, and a single ruby. Now, I had everything apart from rubies because I think I sold them to buy the sitting duck fishing rod, which I still argue is an amazing thing that we did. Is this a way up? It is. Too fast, I can't get up. Wait, is that way up? No, it's a solid block. It looks like a background wall. Interesting. Interesting. So yeah, we already we already found the rubies. So that is taken care of, not a problem. What's down here? What are you hiding from me down here? Nothing of importance. Can I swim? No, but I can use my tornado y didgery bobbery do. Uh, so yeah, that is the again with the traps. So many down here. Maybe I should be picking up the um... oh crystal hat. Picking up the pressure plates as well. But there's another trap. Now until we get to hard mode, uh, or even until we can get into the Lazard Temple which is a long way away. Our traps are going to be 
the basic ones. We can't get any good traps. What are these? Is that just lead ore, just exposed? Why does it look so, um... Get out of it. Shiny. I don't mean shiny, I mean like... It looks like gems. Yeah, it's just lead ore, I don't care. Uh, so I can get out of here anytime I want. I'm just dropping down because I can't... Is that another trap? Yep. Yep. Oh, we're gonna have lots of traps. Ready for when we want to build our actual base. Okay. <laughs> Let's put these torches down. Uh, I'm going down just because I can. What is that? Emeralds. I definitely need these. I actually do need a bunch of emeralds. Not for the... Um, what's it called? Not for the slime crown or anything, but for the let's build itself. Pad of let's build I need emeralds for. So I'm taking those. Is that more? No, it's silver ore. See, while we're down here, we're just gonna... We're just gonna collect a few things. Hey! We can, we can leave any time we want. I got stuck. It's actually terrifying being trapped in some kind of underground cave just wedged in by your head. And that has happened to people, and they've died. You know, out exploring caves all on their own, and they don't think to tell anyone, and they get wedged. And then no one can come and save them until they slowly die of starvation or dehydration. And honestly, that is terrifying to me. That just see, seems terrifying, just trapped on your own for like three or four days until you slowly die. Unable to move. It would drive you insane knowing... Knowing that you're going to die, basically. You can't get out of it. You'll have struggled for days. So you know you're going to die. You know no one's going to find you. It's horrible. And you, the, the claustrophobic... I'm not claustrophobic, but it must feel so claustrophobic being, like, physically trapped. Oh, it's horrible. Horrible. Undead Viking... Uh, I mean, I could kill him for... His helmet, but... Ah, no! I did the double dash thing again by accident. Now, if I find any, uh... Cool statues around here, that'd be cool. Granite elemental, that means I'm near a granite biome. They're a great way of helping you find granite biomes, by the way. Where am I going? Doesn't matter where I'm going. I'm just looking around, just exploring... Oh, there's more amethysts. We could find anything. We've been here. But I haven't been down here. Ah! Ice slime! This is the marble biome! Excellent! Now I know there's another marble biome. This is a fairly large one as well. Alright. Please leave me. Please. Please leave me alone. So yeah, you guys tell me to go and reforge my weapon and stuff. I could. But the problem with that is you guys would have to see the Goblin Tinkerer in my world. Hey. And you don't want to see him because uh, then you would see my base and stuff. And I can't ruin that yet. Please don't bother me while I'm over here. I'm trying to do... Oh, great. That was a freaking... Okay, here we go, here we go. You ready for this? I can do it, I can do it. Look at that. Like a professional, did no damage to me. I mean, he did some, but it was next to no damage. Look at all that beautiful shiny ore up there. What is it? What is up here? Copper? Lead. I don't want lead. I mean, I'll take this gold, because that's always good. Slush is always good for when I use my extractor data. Which I'm not doing right now. <gasps> a cabin! It's a snow one as well. It's a boreal cabin look. I didn't even see this. There are some statues here, which I already have. There's a granite golem. What's in the chest, though? Another frost brand. Uh, it's also a bad one. I saw ice torches. Cool. Uh, give me that chest. Uh, 
And I will take the mushroom statue. Because I don't think I have that one. It does nothing though. Uh, inventory is full. I don't need this painting. Uh, minus 10 speed. And this is not back right here. Yeah, I suppose it's not back. So okay. Boreal wood can go. I don't need ice. I don't need pressure plate. I don't need snow or a single mud block or two hand sand or seven of that. Uh, that'll do. There is a hoplite coming to kill me. I'm hoping I can kill him like this. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. This is fine. What we do is we do that. We quickly find some dirt. Never mind, he's coming in. Come on, come down here. You've got an unfair advantage up there. What was that flash? Haha! 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 Well, we use this dirt to seal ourselves. In. What was that? Who just shot me? Who just tried shooting me? Right, where am I going on the map? Uh, Alright, let's dash out of here. That's not what I wanted. Oh! Take that. I'll take that. Thank you. Um, I want to... Oh, I see you. I see you up there and I need you, emeralds. Come here. Get in my life. Alright, let's try this. Yep. Oh, Lord, it's a dead end. This is fine. This is fine. What I'm going to do is like this. Look. Check this out. Ha! Ha ha! Gotcha! Oh, I can't jump up here. Look at these skills! So this should take me down... Oh wait, that's not a drop. Can I mind that? Ah! How do you get in here? Get out. Let's mine this. Cyan beetle and a granite golem. Well, here's what we do, look. You ready for this? I'm gonna go. Boop! Oh no! Okay, that's fine. That'll work. Another one. Beautiful, now I can go kill that guy without worrying about dying. <laughs> I so very nearly died. <laughs> oh wow. I cannot believe how close that was. Right, let's keep going down. I'm not even collecting this stuff. Oh, there's a granite biome. Which we don't care about, but hey, we found it. Get some oxygen. And we go back down. I'm a little bit concerned about my health, though. There's another cabin! Oops, get in the cabin. Right, what do we have? It's another ice cabin as well. Could get another frost. <gasps> What's this? Fish! We can get a baby penguin! Oh! Give me all that. I need this. I need this. I want this. What can I get rid of? Uh, that. Goodbye. We're going to get ourselves a baby penguin, boys. And girls. Where is he? There he is! I'm going to... I'm going to zoom in so you can see. Look at this, baby penguin! Baby penguin! Come on, baby penguin, let's go! Follow me! There he is! Baby penguin! I'm so happy we have, we have a pet. A glorious pet. Uh, I'm going to do this, which might seem strange, but trust me. Trust me on this, because now we can reach there to put a torch down, and over here to put a 
torch on somewhere. Maybe. Gotta dig a little bit further. I want to be able to put torches down, then we can see whereabouts we are gonna head before we head there. Oh, that was from underwater. Okay. Which is why I can't put my torch on there. Do I want to go through the granite biome? Is that a chest? Down there? No, it's not. I can see that on the map and it's not. It's a trap though. Right, here's what we're going to do. We're open this. Penguin, you scared the crap out of me. I thought you were an enemy. There's another building! It's a rabbit stuff. Oh, there's so much stuff. So much stuff. Right, give me all this. I need to open the piggy bank. Deposit into... Oh yeah, you guys told me as well. Wow. Uh, I managed to destroy some... Um, whatever it's called. Am I dying? That's not me. Destroy some things that I wanted to keep, like the mushroom chest and the strange plant. Because as I was pushing square to deposit something into my piggy bank, I got knocked out of my piggy bank, so pushing square put it in my bin. How horrible is that? Spiked flurry boots. So flurry boots, I think, are the icy version of a... Um... They're an icy version of the Hermes boots, right? I think that's how it is. I need to clear stuff. I don't need ice or snow, but I'll probably mine up more. Don't need rope or stone. You know, I'll keep the stone blocks. Don't need that. I don't want lead or. Everything else is fine. Okay, right. Let's torch the place up a little bit. No! No, how did, why did you open that door? I didn't say to open that door. Close that door. Close that door. Close the door. There we go. Right, map. So we've been over there. Do we go down? Should we go down? I do kind of want to end the episode soon. Oh, Lord, this is terrible. What's this next to me? I think there's a statue next to me. There's a jellyfish coming to kill me, though, which is horrible. Ah! I didn't realise this was a, a drop-off. That was just pure luck. I was trying to mine into a little cubby hole so I could heal. Oh, it's a, it is a statue. It's a shield statue, which is completely useless. But I want it. Wherever it is, there it is. All right, so this is going to completely flood over because I've... Oh, the penguin is terrifying me. I keep thinking it's like a worm creature trying to kill me. There's another cabin. There's loads of cabins. Holy crap. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Ten around. That's because I got my builder's mode on. Right. Inside here, what do we have? I cannot see. Um, I need to drain the water. Ah, so we can do that by making obsidian. So I might... This is going to be horrible. This is going to take a million years. Also, it's like pitch black, so I can't see. Right. Okay. We'll do this. It's going to get us a bunch of obsidian. So we can make the obsidian skull if we needed to, finally, because we do have the thingy on us. It also gets rid of this lava, which is handy. But no, there's too much stuff. Right. I think what I need... Do I... Yeah, I do have glow sticks. I'm going to say, I think I need glow sticks and I have them. Okay, that's fine. Because we'll be able to see now. The only issue was I couldn't see what was in this building. And now I can. There is... Ooh, I don't know what that statue is. Is it like a gargoyle statue? And a boomerang statue? Gargoyle and boomerang. Okay. I need oxygen. Excuse me. Thank you. And then there's a chest in here. Which has a flare gun and stuff, so I'll take what I can. Mine up the chest. Get the glow stick back out so I can see. There's a pot. Okay. 
Okay, right, let's try this again. Just throw one of those in there. Um, and then what is out here? Looks like nothing, actually. Oh, crap. Giant Shelly, I wasn't expecting you to show up down here. I thought you'd... Ah! Did you see that? It came right at me. It came right at me. I got you, Shelly. Did it drop bombs? I think it just dropped bombs on me. I need to rid myself of some stuff again. No, we're okay, we're okay. Right. Let's check the map. Look to those cabins. That seems to go nowhere. We're going to head this way. That penguin scared me again. I thought it was something chasing me down. Stop it. Okay. Oh, trap. All right, there is gold up here, which again is something I was hoping for. So let's take it. Because gold works similarly to platinum in that we can use it to summon the king slime. So it's going to give us many attempts. And honestly, we want we want to have plenty of attempts on him. Oh, another trap! Stop this! Stop it! What's this? Ooh, got an enchanted sword. 25 damage is even better than my freaking thingamajig one. Shoot an enchanted sword beam. Hey, stop it. Oh, this is, this is so much better than my freaking fr ice blade. Uh, 25. So it's like 7 points stronger. Very fast speed compared to very fast speed. Uh, average knockback and enchanted sword beam. Its range feels a little bit shorter. But you know, it's fine. Wait, is this what you guys have been telling me about? Is like one of those things in a shrine? What is down here? I need to know. Um, you guys say me to tell me to look for shrines and stuff at the edges of the world. Is this one of them? Because I never would have found this. I don't see any tunnel. Also, this is really deep down. It's almost at spawn point as well, which is interesting. Ah, oh, we're approaching the half an hour mark. So I do need to end this episode. Hmm. So I haven't fought King Slime. Oh, there's nothing in here. I thought this moss was something special, but it's, it's nothing. Yeah, so I, I haven't fought King Slime, but that will be coming up, I guess. Is that another granite biome? And another trap! I have nearly worked all my way all the way down, look. So, if, in fact, if I go this way. You know, so today has been okay. We found a brand new pet, which is amazing. Is that Ruby? No, it's just moss. We found a brand new pet and a brand new sword. What are you throwing stuff at? What do you think you're throwing stuff at? Get out of here. I actually feel so much more powerful, even though it's only from 18 to 25. I actually actually feel significantly stronger with this. Also, I'm being incredibly lazy and I can't bother to mine, so I'm just going to throw these in. Yo! See that shot? You see that shot? Oh crap. Don't look at that shot. Why do I sometimes take the longest possible way to scroll to my items? I can be right next to one and I'll scroll all the way along. Amethysts! I need those. Well, actually, I don't, but I want them. Inventory is full. Let's get rid of mud. I'm so happy with finding this sword. There's a queen statue. I definitely need that. And it's on top of some um, sapphires as well, I believe. So I want this. Penguin, you scared me. Stop scaring me. Uh, get rid of one of those. Diamonds. I want... As many diamonds as possible, which I know sounds a bit silly, but uh, I'm going to use them for torches because they are the brightest torches there are. 
So for those of you saying about um, ultra bright torches, ultra bright torches uh, are weird in the way that they work. So it's going to explain it because you don't understand. But what was that? What was that ruby? No. Um, ultra bright torches work like this. They are incredibly bright. I think even possibly the brightest if you hold them. If you hold them in your hand. But when they are placed, they are only as bright as a regular torch. So using them to you know, light up a, a building, you might as well just use regular torches. But if you're using them to... You've got a thing inside you. If you're using them to... I don't care. It's a recall potion. If you're using them to... Uh, carry around with... Then they're definitely worth using. Don't knock me into that lava. There we go. It's fine. So if you're just carrying around like what I have in my hand right now, Ultra Bright Torch is the way to go. If you're placing them anywhere, you might as well just use regular torches. Baby Penguin, are you okay sat in that lava? I feel like it might just be a little bit too hot for you. I still got caught by that lava. Do you see me jump to try and dodge my baby penguin? It scares me so much. This lava is pretty terrifying. I did it. There are emer there are emeralds there. Okay, I can I can do this. I can do this. We only have to lower the um ground by a bit. Just gonna keep throwing bombs in. We're getting, oh, we're getting lower. So if I do this, it's going to be dangerous. But it will work. Um, there's a salamander in there. Should we go in and kill him? They are dangerous, it could kill me. Got him. Got him. Right, I need. I do have emeralds. Yes, so I can. I can definitely pick these up as I try. Right, if I stand here. I don't think it will hit me. It did, but whatever. We got him. We got him. I'm gonna go up to up to this mushroom biome before I end because there could be anything in there, and it also has the best music available. Oh, I. Need. Get rid of that. I never use those. I always collect them because they could be incredibly useful. And then they aren't. Is that a skeleton statue or just a skeleton frozen in place with fear? Alright, I want this. Uh, uh, screw it. Let's get rid of Shiverthorn Seeds. And then I want this. Definitely want this. This is going to be very important for us. Yeah. I need to get rid of a... Four potions. Skeleton statue. Very, very important. What do I mean by important? I mean, um, not a lot, but they could become they could become useful in the future because they can spawn skeletons. You can make um, money grinders and um, enemy farms and all sorts of stuff like that. I think I may die from poison damage now. I can drink a potion. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to end the episode. There's another railway. I think what I'm going to do is end. There's a chest. Oh my god. There's, there's too much stuff. Right. Okay. We need to. We just need to take five here really quickly. Get on my way. Get on my way. Drop in here. There is a worm coming for me. Got it. Right. I'm not going to drown while I'm here. I need to. Actually, can we put a torch out? There we go. Let's get the piggy bank out. Let's access it. Right, let's start putting stuff away.
um, that I know I can stack in here. Okay, now we, we now have plenty of room. So, since we have plenty of room, let's loot the place. Magic mirror and gold bars and stuff, excellent. Give me the chest. I can't take it. I'm going to use my sword like an idiot. Okay. Then we have this water chest. Look, a water chest. Hey! I didn't even see you there. Water chest has water walking boots. Interesting. We haven't had those yet. I do like getting stuff we haven't had. All right, why hide back in here? Because it's safe. Check the map. I don't see any other houses around us, but I know there's a railway up there. Ah! I'm too inquisitive. 30, 30, it's like 35 minute long video here. Right, I will. I will end this. I promise you. There's another granite biome there. We've made huge progress. We really have. Please. Please. I defeated my 50th cave back. Cool. Right, let's go up. This is fine. I know it looks stupid what's going on here, but it's working. It's working. Alright, go for the silt. Right, stop. Just calm down. Put a torch down. Where did I want to be? On this side. Okay. We're just going to go across here and look at the railway track. It's probably not going to take us anywhere fantastic because it looks like it heads straight into a wall. However, oh lordy. However, here's the here's the dealio yo. I like to explore. Don't kill me. It's frozen me. It's frozen me. Oh lordy lord. I've never seen that. I thought the Ice Queen was the only one who had the power to freeze. I will free you, jellyfish. I will free you from your captivity. So it looks like it doesn't ah doesn't really go anywhere special. Oh, but maybe it does. Maybe it does. Right, we need to let's go. Let's go. Now, I was asking you guys about whether or not it was worth making the other minecart. And you said it's only a little bit faster and it deals more damage to enemies and stuff. Um, don't waste iron on it. But at this point, you know, we're not really using iron for anything, so maybe I should. Have we been here? We have. And we never went on this railway. What is wrong with me? How did I not see the railway? And a trap. Which has poisoned me. And it means I'm going to die. Right. Don't do that. Right. Are these two two puzzles? I believe these are indeed topazes. So, we get rid of that. We've got some topaz. That's lead. I don't care. Oh, come on, move. Complain that I can't move very fast. And I... Literally stood on a minecart track. Stop. Right, so I'm going to get the heck out of here. And I'm going to return home. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the surface. I'm going to warp out of here to the surface. But then I'm going to go back to our main world. Dump off all this crap. Come back to this world. And then we're going to fight King Slime, I guess. Maybe have a bit of more of an explore down here, because... You know, this place is actually looking really freaking good. I really want to go on this side of the world. But I can't. But you know what, hey, we don't... There's a building! I have to now that I can see a building there. Crap! I tried, guys. I tried to leave. 
But every time, every time I try to get out of this place, it tempts me with more stuff. Slime statues! Ah, oh, come on! Get out of there! Maybe we're in a spiderweb biome. Because there's so many spiderwebs here. Right, okay, what do we have? I think I can take some of this, but not all of it. Yeah, the magic mirror. So, you know what, do that. Throw that on the ground. And we're good. There are no statues in here, which is unfortunate. You know, it's like the, the main reason I check out these houses is for, well, the chests and the statues. There's an emerald! There's an emerald! I promise you, we're, we're, we're going to end this very shortly. There's so many emeralds! Okay, well, I need to throw away rope. Take this. Snufflings. There's another emerald! And a heart statue! I got it. Uh, let me in. I'm gonna fight the Snufflings. Give me a snowman cannon. They did it. Alright, Mother Slime can't hit me here. That's fine, because I'm gonna bring out this boy. I'm gonna open him up. We're gonna throw in emeralds. I'm gonna drop down, grab the life crystal. We're going to throw in the life crystal, uh, chest, some shoes, uh, magic mirror. Going to unlock that for a sword in there. We need to get ourselves a safe. We really do. Because we've got... We've run out of space when we're exploring. Although maybe I shouldn't explore so much. I'm asking to die. I haven't even put my money in the safe, you know. My piggy bank. Alright, you just... Please go away. Please. Please. Thank you. Right. I've got 12 gold on me. If I died and lost that, you guys would hate me. Um, quick stack. There we go. Hey, we've emptied our inventory a little bit. Another cabin! Come on. There's a keg. I kind of do want to take a keg, actually. And another cloud in a bottle. And more gold bars. Oh, God. No, please. Just stop giving me stuff, game. You've given me too much. There's a statue I've never seen before. It's like a corrupted statue or an Eater of Wealth statue. I've never seen that before, and I want it. Right. Sorry, please. I just... Can I have two minutes? I don't ask for a lot in this game. Corrupt statue. Is that new? I feel like it is. There's a grave up there, so I've died here at some point. I've like come full circle. So you know what? If I've come full circle, that is the best opportunity for me to leave this world. And get out of here and go home. And do what I said I was going to do. Dump off all this stuff. I can't get out. I can't get out of this place. I want to go up there. Can I go up here, please? Why can't I not? Please. I want to go up here. <laughs> there we go. Right. Okay, that's the end. I'm going home. I'm leaving this place. How do I do that again? This one. Thank you very much for watching. Tune in next time when we uh, do all the stuff I said. For now, though. Goodbye.